frustrating, not it? Uh, really frustrating. Um, we were in the game doing doing well. Probably should have went in at half time, a goal or two up with the chances that we had or the opportunities that we created. Um, then we, we can see the terrible goal for a set piece, and it's like the story of our season. We are, we're playing well, and we just kind of give them a goal. Um, obviously, we get back into it, but. It's, it's again, it's, it's hard to say because it's the story of our season. We just see the terrible goal. We need to block the shot. We need to obviously deal with it bef way before it gets to the point it has. Um, and yeah, we couldn't get couldn't get another goal. I was going to say that again and again we talk missed chances at one end and, and defensive lapses at another. Why does it keep happening though? I don't know. Maybe it's that anxiety. Uh, maybe missing the chances previously, and it's just getting that that leading the game and hopefully the goals will come because we're creating the chances every every week so we've just got to believe that you know one day we will take most of them and when we do that it's it's going to be a different outcome than, than tonight but um, we, we just we've got to stay positive I know it's hard to hear but we've got to take the, the, the positives out today um, and show that you know these are on a great run and we you know we uh, we done we done well it's as I said it's hard to hear but we've done well apart from the goals and and not scoring uh, which is the two most important things but we, we've got to take the positives as well you've played this one for a number of years now you you understand what it takes to, to be successful at, at this level and, and obviously it's a real battle this year for Lincoln City do you feel your teammates are up for the battle up for the fight 100 percent I think hopefully the fans can see it um you know there's there's not a single person in the squad that I wouldn't trust to you know Carry out our, our role or responsibility that the manager or the coaching staff have asked them. You know, they're honestly they're a great group of lads, and um, you know I've got every confidence that uh, everyone everyone knows where we are and they're up for it. Is the manager getting more and more frustrated? Um, I don't know. You need to you need to ask him, but I, c I can only imagine what he's feeling in terms of seeing us play well in between both boxes and then not scoring, not scoring, and then conceding a, a stupid goal and. Uh, yeah, yeah, you need to ask him, but I can, I can guess that hopefully, um, you know, he, w he won't be frustrated one once we get get those chances, uh, score those chances. Um, big game on Saturday, isn't it, against Gillingham? Uh, you look at the table; things have gone well for you tonight, but it needs to go well again on Saturday, doesn't it? Yeah, we need to start uh, not relying on other teams, uh, not picking up points. We need to do the business ourselves, and um, I said we've got to take positive for tonight. We've got to. Um, Look at the things we've done well. Of course, we're going to look at the things that we didn't do so well. We've already had a, a good chat about it in there, um, and we've got to have a positive frame of mind going into the Gillingham game because if you don't, then you know you're already you're already on the back foot. So we've got to take positives for tonight, and um, and you know take it into the game.